Hey everyone, welcome back to Freebies Coupons Reviews. I have my May Ipsy unbagging for you today. And let me tell you, the subscription boxes have been killing it this month. My Birch Box was awesome, and my Ipsy is also awesome. Um, I haven't been happy with what I've been getting in Ipsy, not sort of like excited happy also in a few months. So uh, this is a really nice redemption for both Birch Box and, and Ipsy. The first thing is the bag that the items came in this month, and it, it says VIP, very important products, breakups to makeup. I love this bag. It's a canvas material, so it will get dirty. You can see it actually kind of came with a little bit of a scuff mark on it. <clears throat> but I, I love lipstick. I love makeup. I think this bag is adorable. So the first thing that I got in the bag is by a company called Ami, A-M-I-E, Naturally Kind Morning Dew Matte Finish Moisturizer Cream Hydrate Matte Finish. Oh, then it says controls oiliness and shine, hydrates and softens. So this is a natural moisturizer. Again, I'm not the biggest fan of getting moisturizers because I like to kind of stick with what I know, but I am a fan of getting natural products that I can try out. So um, I've never heard of this brand. It's a nice size sample. I'll definitely be able to tell if I like it as a moisturizer or not. Um, so, you know, thumbs up for a natural brand that I haven't heard of before. The next thing is an awesome sample. It's from Urban Decay. Let's see if I can focus. There you go. Um, it's from Urban Decay Revolution High Color Lip Gloss. So it's basically a lip gloss sampler that also comes with a, uh, what they call a primer pencil. So there are these two colors to try out. This is in Fail Bait and also in Bittersweet. So these are um, high color lip glosses and you have the full uh, line here. It's a new line. So it says Revolution High Color Lip Gloss, High Am Impact Color, Badass Shine, um, Get Primed and Ready for Action. So the pencil is actually pretty cool. The pencil is just a, you can see that, it's just a basically clear pencil. Um, so it's a primer. It goes on as a primer, and uh, what I'm going to use it for is a lip liner prim primer. So basically I'm going to line my lips with it so that my lipstick doesn't um, fray around the edges. And I will, um, I will try these colors. I am a fan of bright, crazy colors, so that is right up my alley. I am also always a fan of getting eye brushes. This is a tapered blending eye brush in the number 205 by a company called Luxie, which I've never heard of before. Um, but it's a really beautiful rose gold type looking eye brush and it is quite soft. Uh, so I am excited. It's soft in a good way for a blending brush. It's not too, too um, widely spaced out. It has a little bit of density, but it's still soft and will definitely blend. And I just think it's really pretty. I think it's a really pretty um, color combination and I love the little rose gold hardware so very happy always happy to get an eye brush super happy about that the next item is from a brand that I've gotten in the past from Ipsy that I really liked and it is Briogeo and this is the Rosarco Milk Reparative Leave-In Conditioning Spray so it's a leave-in conditioner and I have gotten the um, deep repair mask from them before it's called don't despair repair and that thing is awesome so i can only imagine that the briogeo will be just the leave-in conditioner will be just as awesome and i'm super happy super 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 happy to get that because i use leave-in conditioners pretty much every day and the next thing in the box or the last thing in the bag i should say is by bella pierre cosmetics um, we've gotten this brand before. It's something that Ipsy throws in a lot. And <clears throat> to be honest, it's something that I think a lot of people have kind of gotten sick of getting. But this is an interesting product. This is their gel eyeliner in ebony. So this is what the pencil itself looks like. It has a super soft, I mean, super, super, super soft. And that's not going to be able to focus. There you go. Um, a super, super soft tip and application. 
Um, it's in the color ebony, as I mentioned. It says that it is the number two. And it's basically meant to be a gel eyeliner in pencil form, which is what makes it super, super um, soft and creamy. And I did swatch it for you guys here. It has nice pigmentation. It is extremely, extremely creamy. Um, so you know what? It's, it's another black eyeliner, and I think some people would complain about that. But for me, a nice, soft, matte black eyeliner, um, I can never go wrong with that. So... I'm not complaining this month. So uh, again, these are the items that I did receive. I think, you know, the one that I probably am least excited about, to be honest, is this moisturizer. But even the moisturizer is a new company that I haven't heard of, and it's a natural brand, so there's not much to be complaining about. The Urban Decay sample is obviously amazing. It's not just the lip glosses, it's the um, lip primer pencil, which I am super, super, super happy about. The blending brush is really cute and beautiful, and I'm sure it'll be great. The leave-in conditioner, I love leave-in conditioner, and I love that brand. I know it does uh, makes really good hair care products. Eye pencil, nothing to, to complain about, and this super cute uh, makeup bag. So all in all, a really, really, really good bag from Ipsy this month. And um, yeah, I, I was very, whoops. <laughs> I was very, very pleased. So thumbs up, Ipsy. Um, if you guys get Ipsy, please let me know what you got in the, in, in your bags this month. Um, I know these bags come in a variety. There were actually three different um, versions of the bag this month, which is unusual for Ipsy. So let me know if you got a different version. I know there's one with just like a lipstick and one with, I think, maybe just a mascara and something else. Um, and did you like your bag as much as as, as, as I did this month? Because um, I was pretty stoked. So, again, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give this video a thumbs up. And subscribe to um, our channel if you haven't already. I would really appreciate that. And I'll be back with some more videos very, very soon. Bye, guys.